Hi everyone, about a minute from the Atlanta airport. I'm connecting here today um, from Savannah to Austin. I'm gonna get on my plane uh, to go back home here in a minute. Um, but I thought this would be a good time to think about or talk about how much energy we consume on a daily basis and think nothing of it. And the figures are absolutely gobsmacking. Uh, so how did I do the calculations? Well, I relied on ChatGPT, which is amazing. If you haven't done it, you should try it. So I asked ChatGPT, calculate approximately how much energy is consumed by the jets that fly through Atlanta every day. Well, as you probably know, and it did, and it came up with an answer very quickly. And as you know, Atlanta airport is one of the world's busiest airports, something like 2,700 flights uh, leave here every day. So ChatGPT did the calculations, looked at the small, medium, and large aircraft that go through here. What did it come up with? 11.2 million gallons of jet fuel are consumed every day by the jets that fly through here. Okay, so that's a big number. How do you make sense of it? Well, there are 6.7, pounds uh, of jet fuel per gallon. So that works out to about 34,000 metric tons of, of jet fuel. Okay, well, that's an interesting term, but I thought, okay, well, what about electrical energy? Maybe that would be the easier way to understand it. So converted that jet fuel, 11.2 million gallons to electrical energy, it's around 442 million kilowatt hours. Okay, the average American home uses about 11,000 kilowatt hours per year, therefore, the amount of energy consumed in the form of jet fuel every day by the, the airplanes that leave Atlanta is equal to the electrical energy that is consumed by 40,000 American homes in a year. So I'll repeat it. The amount of energy that's consumed in the form of jet fuel by the planes that leave Atlanta airport every day is roughly equal to the amount of electrical energy that's consumed by 40,000 American homes in a year. That scale is, is really just amazing. But another indicator of the fact that we forget and take for granted the amount of energy we consume and really don't think uh, anything about it. And the Atlanta airport is just another example of the massive amounts of energy that we consume on a daily basis. Okay, I'm going to go get on my flight. Uh, you know where to find me. I'm on Substack, robertbryce.substack.com. Thanks a lot. See you.